what's up guys and welcome back to the channel so guys today 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 we are going to be testing out a very brand new shark and i'm actually pretty excited to be doing this so i'm taking advice from one of my um previous comments and we are going to be testing out the shark and yes guys here he is the shark now I've already looked to see what he does. I haven't seen any videos on it, but it says that he can mimic the pyro, ice, and electric shark abilities, which seems pretty cool in theory, but we're really just going to have to get inside of this thing to check it out for myself because it seems pretty fun, but like, how does it work? Do I have to eat the fish first? Do I have to, um, do I have to do something special for it? How long do I keep the abilities and a bunch of things like that? But we're going to be seeing all of this right about now. So here we go. We actually start off a lot smaller than I was expecting. But um, I guess all of these might start at this size. I actually don't really know. Now we're about the same size as a bomb. So we actually are a little bit small. But all right. So we don't have any normal abilities. Could we fly or anything? Let's see when we jump across it. Oh, well, we leveled up pretty quick. We already got a level two. Okay, so we definitely can't fly. Um... We're not losing too much health going on land, so that might be something good. But let's just go over here to this um little area next to the side. Ooh, let's go and try to... Okay, so, we're, so we are pretty weak. Oh, well, he sticks his tongue out as well, which is something that's uh, good to note. Doesn't seem to be actually doing that much work, and his radius does seem pretty small, but it's fine so far. Let's go and try to get across. Okay, we're definitely not going to make across that side. So we can't move across land fast, so we're going to have to go around here to over here to this area next to the Titanic place because um usually they spawn a they usually spawn a pyro shark, so it actually makes it much much easier to find and let's see. Okay, no, he didn't actually spawn just yet, so we might have to go out and um and look, we might actually need to go inside the Titanic place to find the ice shark actually because I don't know if they spawn in the main world or not and I don't, I, I don't know where they spawn, even if they do, because I don't think I've really seen any of them, so that, that's also going to be a thing, but electric sharks usually also spawn um, near the edge, so I'm going to try not to go too far down, ooh, we leveled up again, we're already level 4, okay, so we do level up pretty fast, which is a good thing um, that he has, but yeah, so I just really want to see what it what it's like when we actually cast their abilities. Because do you keep them and can you use like multiple ones at once? I feel like that'd be a little bit busted. But I mean, it, it'd, be, it'd be a cool little ability. Okay, now we're next to this underwater current. Only thing is, this man has like horrible chomp and horrible radius. Not chomp, it's called bite. But he has horrible bite and a pretty bad radius. Like you see this? Like he sticks out his tongue, but he stick. Ooh, okay, we just went invisible. Oh, we got an ice shark. Okay, 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 okay. All right, so, I'm. Um, all right, so, all right, so yeah, that's so. Okay, so it's like we're basically an ice shark now. Okay, all right, all right, all right. That's cool. So we're like an ice shark. This is actually. Oh, ooh, can we get two abilities at once? Um, no, it roasted. Okay, okay. Can you? Hmm. All right, that's a little bit strange. Can you just only use one shark's ability at once? Um, because if so, then this isn't as broken as I thought, and it has a timer. Okay, so it just turned off, um, I don't know. I don't know how I'm feeling so far. Ooh, can we get a Robo Shark? Okay, why is it not breaking it again? Because if I have to get two hits on it, then it's, ooh, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to get two, yeah. I don't, Robo Shark isn't worth trying to get it. It only said Pyro, Ice, and Electric, so I'm not even gonna take the risk. But yeah, and okay, so it def so it has a timer, which is one thing to note. Um, it has a timer, which is one thing to note. Um, you get the abilities. You can only use one ability shark at a time, which is something that I don't necessarily like. But I mean, hey, I mean, I I mean, I don't really. I mean, I guess I can understand because if you had like fire and ice, like which abilities would it take priority? But I mean, whichever one you ate second could take priority and then just give like certain abilities. Because I'm thinking more so with like the electric shark. Because the electric shark, you just run forward and then it like a lightning shocks everything. So like a lightning radius. So that's why I was saying it'd be better if it um allowed you to use multiple. Maybe it might be like that and just might not work with fire and ice. Maybe you can only use whichever one you already have. So yeah, but I mean, I would at least expect you to be able to eat it. Because if you can only have one and for the duration, then I don't really think... It's all that good so far, but I don't know. It was also a split second where we went invisible, which is something cool, and I really want to see how that works because that means that the chameleon actually has a unique ability of his own. But now, let's try to go test out this fire shark. Hopefully, it spawned over here. 
Uh, okay, I didn't mean to actually get up in the sky. So go back down. Hopefully it spawned. And let's eat this dive real quick because our health is looking pretty low, which is not very good. We're actually very, very low. Oh, we went invisible again. Okay, ooh. Okay, okay, now we got the pyro shark. All right, all right, all right. Actually, this thing actually looks pretty cool as a fire. Woo, 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 woo. Ooh, same roasting abilities, same abilities. Do we can fly like it? Can we fly like it? Okay. Oh, oh, wait, we're not going down. Wait a second. Oh, so we can fly permanently. Okay, ooh, we got a gem. Okay, so we can actually fly permanently, which is something that's actually pretty, pretty cool. I don't know how I'm feeling, though, because granted, we could fly forever, and that may or may not be cool, but like... Yeah, now it dropped, and now we're over here. Okay, we went invisible again. Did you say... Whoa, what is this? Why, why do we keep going invisible? Hmm, that's that's strange. I don't know. We keep going invisible. Oh, and we're about to lose this. Oh, well, time to watch an ad. Here we go. All right, we just got back from the ad, and somehow we ate the Megalodon, yet we couldn't need... Didn't it just now say we need a bigger shark? So... And we're already level 7, and he's actually pretty small to say he's a level 7. Eh, I don't feel like fighting the submarine. This shark is this shark is weak. Um, where are we at? Okay, so guys, I don't know how I'm feeling so far about this because this this isn't really uh seeming too um too good, especially coming from the fact that um these things are pretty hard to find. So I guess, but I guess we'll be back in a minute when something a little bit cooler happens. I don't know. Oh wait a second, something cool just now did happen. Um, we just went invisible again somehow, some way, and we're level eight. Okay, we just ran straight forward. I didn't. Mi why? Why are we missing this stuff? Why is this radius so bad? Okay, we got a gold rush. Got a very first gold rush. Now, noting this, we did not get any special abilities during the gold. Okay, his radius is so horrible. His thing is like Moby Dick's radius. Is honestly, see, we went invisible. Whoa, what is this? We're invisible. What? What? Why are we invisible? Does what is what does this even do? Oh, there was an electric shark. Okay, okay, okay. Does wait. Ooh, this is actually pretty cool. He actually looks pretty cool as an electric shark. But when we go invisible, does that mean that we're close to a shark that we can take his ability? I think that's what it might mean. Because just about every time we went invisible, well, I think every time we went invisible, or like just about every time we went invisible, we we fought into, uh, ran into a shark. Because I've actually seen us run into the robo, I mean, the not the robo, we ran into the pyro. And a minute after we ran into the um ran into the ice. So this 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 is pretty weird. I I don't know. Yeah, okay, see we're invisible again. The pyro's right there. Okay. So I think you go invisible when you're approaching a shark that might be a shark that you can mimic, which is why we probably didn't go invisible in the air with the Robo Shark. So Robo Shark probably doesn't even work anyway. So this is actually so this is actually like a pretty pretty cool discovery. Now how it's working about this stuff, I, I don't know. Um, it seems, it seems okay. I mean, to be honest with you guys, I, I don't, I, this is, don't get me wrong. It's cool. I, I think it's, I think the idea behind, wait, are we immune to fire? Actually, are we immune to, okay, we went invisible and then we turned to electric shark. So I'm pretty 99% sure when you go invisible, you're close to a shark that is, um, that you can actually absorb. So we lost our ability. So I don't know if we were actually fireproof, but I'm going to assume that we were. Because that's the only thing that would make sense. Actually, we're near this place, aren't we? All right, I know where we are. We're at this place. Yep, here we go. So now everything, hopefully, it gets shocked. Hopefully, I don't lose my sharking ability. Wait a second. Why do we look so weird, though? Don't you guys think that we look different compared to how we use look the first time we used the electric shark? I think we do. Because then we look like more blue than this. Because we're just the basic shark with like a lightning or well, we're at least. Now we got to get ourselves out of here. He doesn't even move that fast. Why is he so stiff? This man's stiff. Anyway, we're probably going to get out of here. And yeah, so let's just go ahead out this place and let's try to find another shark that we can eat. Or I guess we're just going to lose here. Well, I'll see you guys back inside the lobby. All right, guys. So here we go. Um, I test out Shark Helion, as you guys have seen. My final opinions on it. Um, I I honestly don't like him that much. He He's cool for what he is, I guess. But like I don't see a real reason for you to buy him because he's a hundred eighty thousand, and the other two are um the other two are seventy five and twenty five, so they're a hundred thousand. And then if you buy the pyro shark, who is one fifty, I think he is. I don't remember, but he just doesn't seem like that much of a um. He just he just doesn't feel worth it to me, to be honest with you guys. But yeah, I guess. 
that's just that's just my stance on him. You guys might like him. Me personally, I don't find it. I feel like it'd be more of a waste of your money. Just buy whatever shark that you want and just grab their abilities. But guys, I hope all of you enjoyed this video. Um, let me know what future sharks you guys would like me to see and use out, test out. I'm open to using all of these except for Electro and Ice One because I've already used them before. I don't have them unlocked, but I've used them and I don't really want to do anything repetitive. But I hope all of you enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, all those things. And I will see all of you in the next one. Peace.